He says not to give up and see beyond their words. He should see beyond the pain. If there is a chance, it goes away. Maybe I shouldn't give up either. And see a doctor about my knee. The sun is shining. Blackouts. And then just pretend you have a phone. And just pretend you have a phone. And I Alright, and lights up. You don't say I'll be okay in a weekend or two. But still, the thought of them cutting me up is an unpleasant one. The pain will be completely gone. You want me to be coming now, but you just saw it two days ago. My knee has not changed much since then. A different x-ray other than the MRI is needed. No more tubes. I felt like a leprechaun hiding his gold. Oh, I don't know why I'd be quoting leprechauns. I mean, it'd be pretentious nonsense. Old Irish people are supposed to... I'd be walking. I will come now. But still... You won again. I'm on the phone, Sean. The game. You won. You need to learn better manners. I'll be with you in a moment. Still frightens me. But I'll be doing it. I'll come for the x-ray. It's a beautiful day. It's a beautiful, I guess I can walk and not bother Ma Maggie. I'll be doing that. See in a bit. Sean, it'd be nice that you'd be winning the game, but if you see your grandfather on the phone, you wait a minute. I see grandpa on the phone, I wait a minute. Mama did not make you. Then your mama wrong. I'm special. I kicked two and a half balls in the net today. We're all special. It's how you be using it that counts. I kicked two and a half balls in the net today. Now how how you be kicking two and a half balls into the net? It doesn't seem possible. What? Did you cut the ball in half now? I kicked the ball near the net and someone else kicked it in. Then you only got two balls into the net. Read the letter now. My mother said I was special, but said I must be nice. So be nice and read the letter. And it was two and a half balls. I had to go into the doctor. I sometimes want county players' bees and now it's gone. But if I'm raising you, I need be needing a good knee. Good. Maybe you could play soccer, but read the letter. And there are certain shots I learned today in my special botany course that can help chickens produce cleaner eggs. Eggs that can be sold for higher prices. That's very interesting. But why are the letters so important? <coughs> We're fine. You're happy living here in Ireland. And the other people even I accept you. I am special that I know. But if the words will let me go, I can glide to normal life. If all is known, and then the special will go away. You think if you read the letters, you'll suddenly be normal? I think the sadness of my mother, who was mostly happy, caused a difference I do not understand. I just want to remember the happiness. I want to hear birds when they do not sing and not see my mother's face when she thinks of you. Her childhood here cries and ways, cries and ways. You're a stubborn lad. <laughs> You be doing your homework. I'm going to the doctor. You inspired me to get an operation. And I be doing just that. I walk with you. Do your homework. Blackouts. Why are you be using that? The operation was a success. There's no pain anymore. You should be working the knee. I work the knee, but I be doing it with the cane now. The cane should stay home and you should use your knee. You should use your knee. See? You're not even living anymore. 
I feel naked. Don't scare Sean. The, daddy, the thought of your neck could be waking the dead. I'm not afraid of wrinkles. Wrinkles is just skin that is baggy. Grandpa's skin is baggy. You're such a sweet lad. Your dad say he be, be running the farm. But those fences need tending. Maybe should I should tell him to make you do it. He does not like Mr. O'Hara running the finances. But your dad still be running the farm. And to be honest, he doesn't talk do so bad. He's a good worker. We're making a profit now. But, and, he's, and his salary is high, um, from what I hear. But someone should be telling him to visit his father now. I, I saw him and he made a face at me. I, I saw him and he made a face at me. I was talking to Patrick. What, what type of face did the laddie make? He's not a lad. Liam and I are lads and so is Patrick. When I saw him, I could not help but sticking out my tongue. You should be a comic. <laughs> be a performer and get on stage. I do not like when people laugh at me. But this be different. They'll be laughing with you and not at you. But I uh, you, you are the star of the football team. Football is the greatest of 15-year-old Irish boys. But I want to be a Lego coach who will bat in this. This headmaster gave more of that to my studies because he says I have aptitude. I have aptitude. It sounds like appetite, but it means I am good. I am good. The, our farm can be better. Our farm can be better. We can, we can. Be Jesus, focus on the football today. It is like basketball, but on the ground. It is like basketball, but on the ground. And I will be an agricultural botanist. The headmaster said it is an intelligent farmer. It is an intelligent farmer. I think I will be joining you if I don't get that letter from Trinity College. You sure you don't want us to be walking into the field or at least at least home, and you'll get the letter. No, I will play soccer from five to six, and then I will go home and eat the sandwich that you made for me. I'll eat the sandwich that you made for me, Patrick. And I like walking the fields at six o'clock. At six o'clock, the sun is going down, but the sky is bright orange, even though it makes the green greener. I like that old cow because he looks at me as if he likes me, but never comes close. But yesterday, I came close and he let me pet him. I like the boosters at six o'clock because this, they seem happy. We can add genetic enhancements to the poultry and increase productivity to the farm using herbs. I like the cows and even the roosters. They do not think I am strange. Everything has a soul, I guess. Everything does. And Sean is a popular lad now. I am the best in soccer. You should be exercising humility. How do you exercise humility? Do you put it in your arms and go up and down? <laughs> I believe you made a joke. Ex humility is to be humble. Do not brag. Be yourself. I go that way. Did you? be wishing Patrick a happy birthday now. I did at 8.23 this morning. I think it 8.22. I think it was 8.22 and a half. I will take the cane so you do not forget to not use it. Bye. He seems happy. The headmaster says he's very smart. He retains information. Do you think he can have a normal life? I like him now. He, he surely has a knack for sciences, a science and maybe he can be a science farmer but what is normal? Won't I get the letter eat a white copy? When the letter is in your hand, you'll be getting it. You're such a sage. It's no wonder you're not winning Ireland. <laughs> I'd be 18 and legally drinking now. Oh, I'm sure you'd be drinking before. Nay. Oh, once I had a bit of wine, but I never really liked what it does. You and all are examples of that. I'm glad you don't drink studies after hell anymore. But today, we were flying to heaven. What will I drink? There's a pub. Uh, you've been to the pub many times with me, your da. A whiskey with a beer chaser now. Sounds a bit potent. Will I be passing out and pissing on papers now? Joel, you've been mentioning that. Yeah, but. And lights up. That seems a bit much now. Uh, if you're trying to make me an image, I would rather stick to your words. 
I know you have the small poem in your in your pad in your jacket now that you're gonna melt in the poetry journal. Uh, with only ten or twelve people here, I think it's okay to read. I should not have be agreeing to read that. Um, what would New Age is the most literary magazine in Ireland want with my ramblings? Maybe nothing, but I have mine and also have one of yours. Uh, I was thinking we can read them and maybe mail them across the post after we're done here. It's customary to do these trivial things before one gets south. When a man be flying to the wind, he doesn't want to come back to land and feel its weight. Do those trivial things. I will be riding no winds tonight. I will have one beer, but no whiskey. But you must have one for your birthday. Happy birthday to Patrick. Today, he be a man. Blowing road of quiet calm to coast and see the sparkle. I should not be sending that. Why don't you give it to me? I will read mine if you read yours from your pad. A pub is a place for drinking, not for reading poetry. Quests beyond a pasture stationary and solid. Stationary and solid where fallen birds can rise in peaceful hands. Words, words flowering its scope and curve and glistening fields. Beyond, beyond. Saints preserve us. Patrick be a man, he is in the pub. And why is his whiskey untouched? Ladies don't drink whiskey. So I take it this is one of your drinking days. How's the farm be doing? Any problems to discuss? No. The pub is a place to forget your troubles, not talk about them now. And read poetry. Many come in here to discuss the, their problems. It's a place to unwind. Rain dripping, coming to dripping pot of soft light. Enhancing, enhancing green. I think your man is here, boy. Liam, you are most welcome here. I have a present for you. I, I'm sorry I didn't have a turn to call. I, I told you last week I wanted to see you on your birthday. Yesterday was nice, but not your birthday. But I got you this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I ran into your grumpy and he said that I should meet you here. My birthday be in two months. Are you going to get me something? To, I saw him and thought it would be good to have have him come here. You should not be encouraging this old man. Be perverse and against God. Against God, I say. This confirms that my son is a prancing dandelion boy. I do will not have that said here. It doesn't need to be said it. If you don't, I'll be popping you in your face. Sean Fitzpatrick and Riley, Ryan, whatever your last name is, listen up. My son is a queer. He has sex with the McNulty boy, the son of the richest farmer. And the two will move to Dublin and prance with the fairies. God curses! God curses the... You will take your ignorance out of here, sir. You have no right to tell me what to do! I've been working this farm 12 hours a day and you've been stealing it from me! Just doing it for a pittance! Sit down, then. Sit down and let's have a whiskey. Should have signed the papers. It's not fair, the farm is mine! You will be getting the farm in line with the family trust. But what is the problem with Patrick. He is a good boy. Why do you mistreat? Is there some hidden secret? Because you stole the farm from me. I didn't steal anything. You have the house. You're getting enough money. You, as agreed, you get 40% of the profit. Again, what does this have to do with Patrick? You should accept his difference. You should have signed the papers, you decrepit. You decrepit old asshole! Or 
Many should die 